I can't, it won't let. Hello, welcome everybody to this impromptu episode of the Young Street Reacts. It is an amazing day. We've got Doe, we've got MJ, and we're going to be reacting very, very quickly to a video here. I didn't even tell them what we're going to be reacting to. Therefore, Doe, how you doing? I'm okay. How are you? I'm all right. MJ, how are you? I'm good. Cool. Ben, are you all ready to react to this? Because I'm, I'm gonna ask you, I'm gonna ask you both your opinions at the end of this video. Are you ready? Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Then let's play that tape. You may have Shall heard we? about the flat Earth theory in the last few days because of rapper B.O.B. and his beef with noted astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson. B.O.B. declared to his Twitter followers that he believes the planet Earth is actually flat and that all the nations of the world have joined together in a massive conspiracy to cover up this fact. Here is how flat earthers believe the universe works. They believe the Earth is a flat disk which looks like this. The North Pole is at the center with Antarctica forming an ice wall around the outer edges of the disk. This is why flat earthers believe the 1961 Antarctic Treaty was agreed upon by all the world's nations, so no one could reach the edge of the disk. They believe that this is the reason the UN uses this as their symbol. There is also a dome-like barrier called the firmament which surrounds the disk. This is an impenetrable barrier that keeps the atmosphere intact. Flat earthers do not believe we have ever passed this barrier. According to flat earth theory, gravity does not exist. Instead, they believe in the universal acceleration, believing that all celestial bodies are accelerating upward at a rate of 9.8 meters per second squared. They also believe that Earth is not actually spinning and provide counter evidence to disprove the rotation of the planet such as the fact that clouds in the atmosphere are not moving at the rate of a thousand miles per hour, the rate of the Earth's rotation. Flat Earthers believe that when Copernicus theorized that the Earth moved around the Sun, all of the world's religions decided to accept his theories, and rather than risk being questions, the world's religions have a vested interest in furthering the Earth globe idea. In turn, Flat Earthers believe that all imagery from the space program has been faked. Some of the most common pieces of evidence are the lack of direct commercial flights between two cities within the Southern Hemisphere. Unfortunately, and we are talking to you, B.O.B., all of these theories don't explain why a ship disappears over the horizon bottom first. All right, so we've only got a few seconds, oh, a little bit of time left. We are currently reacting to flat earth theories. All right. Whoo. <laughs> I've got my scientist. I've got my MJ. We've got Sab. What do y'all think about flat earth theories? And that entire video we just watched. My personal opinion, which I know apparently, according to a lot of people, it's very wild, but you can believe anything you want as long as it doesn't hurt other people and you do not force your beliefs upon other people. That is how I see it. Hmm. So they can believe the earth is flat all they want because it's not hurting anybody. And as long as they don't force their beliefs upon other people, I don't really care. Do I believe it? No, no, I don't. <laughs> Our, Dorian, no. but I'm not an asshole and I'm not going to tell them what they do and should not think. All right, that's an understandable reality, even though I find it completely to be wrong. But, no, com come on. Well, I have a problem. I saw I'm just cut off at a moment. Uh, so I missed a part for some reason that is inexplainable. Inexplain but, uh, I really thought these theories had kind of disappeared with, you know, uh, the discovery of, quote unquote, discovery of certain Americas in, back in the uh, 15th century. So here we go. I'm sorry if that sounds bad to anyone, but why would everything else be wrong when the earth is flat? I would love to understand that. Like why would the rest of the universe literally have several dimensions when the earth isn't? That doesn't make much sense to me, but that's pretty much my point. MJ, what about you? I think it's funny to watch these. <laughs> I like, I really, really enjoy watching when um, they, they, they try to prove the earth is flat and it goes our way <laughs> and they prove themselves wrong. Ah, it is always good to see people fail. 
flat on their face. It is wunderbar. Now, Sab, you said this very simple concept. You're like, as long as they don't hurt nobody, don't do it. But see, I believe people are getting hurt by believing that the earth is flat. And here's how. First of all, it hurts my brain having to hear it every time. But <laughs> and my also, is the people that decide to do like ridiculous scientific experiments in the hopes of proving that the earth is flat. Like people who said, oh, I'll take a boat and I'll go all the way to the edge of the earth. And I won't, and I won't need, and I won't need food because at the end there'll be the ice and I'll be able to eat that. That will get you hurt, sir. That will get you no food. Because the water is like a really big desert, but just water. And water that you can't drink because it's salty, like me. So we got, we got to call these people out. The earth is round, ladies and gentlemen. And if you have any questions about this, please refer yourself to YouTube and Neil deGrasse Tyson. He will explain it very, very well. Any, any last thoughts from our co-hosts? The silence is deafening and should tell you everything you know. Anyways, thank you everybody for joining us with this very short yet very fun episode of Young Street Reacts. This is Ryan, that was Doe, that was Sabrina, and maybe MJ, possibly not too sure. Anyways, take care of yourselves and have a wonderful evening. Peace. Oh, like, share, and subscribe. <laughs>